How's that? Better? Hopefully I'm in focus this time. I know last time I wasn't in focus. So, I hope I'm in focus now. Hi! Um, I'm frozen again, as per usual. But it is now the 23rd of December. Yes, 23rd of December. I'm on my way to the farm. We're getting my washing machine and tumble dryer delivered today. So excited. I'm currently waiting for my windows to defrost, as you can maybe see. I can't see out the windows. Um, it's really frosty outside. Like walking to the car, I almost slipped and fell on my butt because it's just very icy. Um, so I'm gonna drive very carefully today because it's a little bit scary. A thing happened also yesterday which made me cry. My favorite sunglasses broke. I it just, it makes me very sad. The arm just snapped off. Now, that did happen before and I super glued it back on and it lasted me like a good another couple months and this time it just snapped off and apparently super glue doesn't stick to super glue. So, it was ruined. It was so sad. So I got some black tape and I taped it back on looking very ghetto fabulous but you know, I love those sunglasses. And my friend Sal gave them to me and I just, I miss Sal, you know, and it's just memories, you know. And Craig is known for, you know, not being able to hold in a surprise because he gets so excited. And he told me that he bought me sunglasses for Christmas. So I was like, oh, I'm very happy. But then there was a surprise gone. <laughs> and then this morning, there was a delivery at the door and he was like, oh, it's here. And I was like, don't say it. I'll wait for Christmas. And we had a little bit of a moment, but long story short, I got my sunglasses. And the great thing is, is that they are almost exactly the same. Look at these. And they fit a bit better because the other ones, I think they were men's and they were, they were big, but like they were also like really big and they were always sliding off my face. Um, but I loved them so much. I just didn't care. But these ones are a lot tighter and they fit a lot better and they're a little, they're more square than the other ones that I had. But yeah, I'm like super excited. And I'm like, okay, fine. Like, I get why he wanted me to have these early. Right, um, this isn't going fast enough. How about my back window? Ooh, there we go. Front. Holla. Let's go. I was going to go get up close to the cows for you guys to see them today, but the mud, no way, not today, because I gotta work in the house some more today, so. Ooh, it's freezing. Okay, so my job today, turn the light on, tidying up this room so that I can start cleaning the walls so we can start painting in here. Okay guys, we are back at the farm. It's a couple days later. I didn't vlog during Christmas because I kind of just wanted a chill day without any camera in anyone's faces. And we had a wonderful Christmas. Uh, so we're back at the farm and we're doing some finishing touches on the kitchen and I'm gonna start in the bedroom. But I thought I'd show you our newest appliance. Our fridge is here. So we bought the higher cube series and it has all these like digital functions that tells you the temperatures and stuff. So we just turned it on 
it, we had it brought in yesterday and we had to wait like 24 hours to turn it on so it's adjusting its temperatures now but and I'm not going to mess with it right now but I thought I'd show you the inside oh, oh my gosh look at that compared to this silly little fridge we have right now I think this whole top area has more storage capacity than our entire fridge freezer at home. So yeah, I'm really happy with my refrigerator. I'm so excited I finally have a big adult sized fridge. <laughs> so I'll show you what we're doing in the bedroom now. So we had, oops, turn the light back on. So we've had a clear out of this room, except for the paint stuff, because that's what we're gonna be needing. Um, so this is the current state of this room. This is going to be our bedroom. We're going, Craig is gonna help me fill these cracks today and any little holes that are on the walls. Why are you making the crack bigger? You're taking basically it's would you stick new plaster on loose plaster? No. Exactly. So I'm taking out all the bad plaster. So I have something hard that's going to cook. Okay. Okay. So, you just so we do that with all the cracks then? Yes. You do that to all the cracks, make them all deeper. The ceiling's going to be interesting, but anyway, you do that. We'll put in hole, just bore out a hole the size of my, the, the straw for the expanding foam, right? and that'll stop these two surfaces wobbling. Okay. So, you try to work the brush into the crack with the what the PVA, right? You just work it in there, just just poking it in. You try to just bind everything back up together. Right, see when those go those cloths. They sign mop up all the excess that I've clarted everywhere. Okay. Okay. Because if you look, because because naturally what will hop happen is. The, the watery mix will pull out some of the plaster and stick it and leave the wall rough therefore giving us extra work as in the sand yeah. okay we had you've had your fill of sanding I have had my fill of sanding so we will so it's all binded the lot two cracks are all binded wipe off all the excess okay we might have a little bit of sand we will have sanding where we fill these cracks okay we don't be sanding whole walls like before. Thank God. So am I doing the class or am I doing the PDA? You're doing everything. I'm doing everything. Okay. Okay. You want, you want your step ladder? No, or I'm you, reaching. Or you want the stool? I'm reaching. I'll give you a stool. Stand on that and see how it feels, how it feels up to you. Okay. Okay, so we have opened the cracks up, filled them, we'll cover them with the PVA glue and then have filled them up. These are all of our patches that we've had to do on this wall. 
And then we had big cracks over here. We're filling and Craig's just filling the last one over there. And then we're going to work on the ceiling cracks. Okay, we are on day two of this. We are now doing the ceiling. These are so far the cracks we've done. We still have this half of the ceiling to do those cracks all up around there. Oh, there's so many. <sighs> okay, everyone. I am done for today as far as scraping out those cracks in the walls and the ceiling. I mean, as you can see, I am so, so dusty and it's all up in my nose and everywhere and I'm trying, I came outside to give myself a bit of a dust and I saw some of the cows. So I'm gonna see if I can get some video of them. I'm really happy that we've started in a new room. Um, actually, I'm gonna just walk on the road. Um, it's really, really icy today. Um, oh, I almost slipped and fell. Um, okay, maybe I should walk on the grass then. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we're doing well. I think we're making really good progress on the bedroom. Um, and I think it's all gonna go really well. Oh, here they are. Oh, hi. Oh, there. You look to be very curious today. You're cutie. Well, I'm gonna sit and hang out with the cows for a bit. See if they come any closer to me. I guess that. <laughs> well, that's it, I guess. So I am going to end the vlog here. Please don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel. It really helps me a lot. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.